Gold, a fascinating and valuable element, has captured human imagination for millennia. Its rarity, beauty and physical properties have made it a symbol of wealth, power. The quest for gold has led to exploration, conquests and sometimes devastation, shaping human history in profound ways. Despite its widespread usage and symbolic significance, much of the gold on Earth is not in the form of nuggets, bars or jewellery. Imagine for a moment the Earth beneath us not just as layers of rock, soil and water, but as a hidden vault, holding vast treasures beyond our wildest dreams. Deep in its heart, the Earth's core is a realm so alien and extreme it captures our imagination and challenges our understanding of what is truly possible. Composed primarily of iron and nickel, this inner sanctum also harbors gold, platinum and other elements that love the embrace of iron, drawn inexorably towards the core during the planet's fiery infancy. This process of differentiation saw our world, once a molten sphere, transform into a layered masterpiece, with the heaviest elements finding their home at the very center. The gold ensconced within the Earth's core is not just any deposit, it's a cosmic endowment possibly delivered to the young Earth by a barrage of meteorites, showering the planet with a galactic bounty after its formation. The quantities we're talking about are almost beyond comprehension, with estimates suggesting there could be several billion tons of gold lying in wait. To put that into perspective, all the gold ever mined by humankind throughout history amounts to a mere 190,000 tons. The core's reserves dwarf this figure, representing a fortune untapped and untouched by human hands. But accessing this treasure is nothing short of a fantasy. Buried roughly 2,900 kilometers beneath the surface, the conditions within the Earth's core are hostile to the point of being otherworldly. Temperatures soar above 5,000 Celsius and the pressure exceeds anything experienced on the surface by millions of times. It's an environment more akin to the surface of the Sun than anything on Earth, defiantly hostile to life and to the machines we might dream up to probe its depths. The idea of drilling robots or other fantastical technologies capable of withstanding such extremes remains firmly in the realm of science fiction, fueling our imagination about the future of exploration and discovery. This grand treasure hunt, comparing the unreachable wealth of the Earth's core with the gold we've managed to extract over centuries, sheds light on a profound truth about our place in the natural world. The Earth holds secrets and riches that surpass our wildest dreams, yet they remain just out of reach, challenging us to push further, to innovate, and to dream bigger. Have you ever thought about the oceans not just as vast bodies of water, but as colossal reserves of gold? It's a compelling image, right? Picture it, 20 million tons of gold, dispersed throughout the seas, silently waiting beneath the waves. It's a concept that stirs the imagination and brings to the surface dreams of untapped riches. However, this is where reality wades in, reminding us of the sheer dilution of this gold, about one gram per 100 million metric tons of seawater, and the monumental challenges that lie in extracting it. This intriguing paradox highlights the incredible abundance of natural resources against the backdrop of our current technological limitations. Diving deeper into this vast blue gold mine, we find seawater to be a complex cocktail of minerals and elements, with gold present only in minuscule amounts. But don't let its scarcity underwhelm you. The total volume of Earth's oceans holds this precious metal in staggering quantities. The origins of this marine gold are as fascinating as they are varied, ranging from river-borne particles washed away from rock formations to underwater volcanic activities spewing mineral-rich fluids into the ocean's depths. Moreover, the dynamic cycle of gold, constantly being dissolved and deposited by natural processes such as hydrothermal vents, adds another layer of intrigue to its oceanic journey. The quest to harness this submerged treasure isn't for lack of trying. History tells us of ambitious attempts, like that of German chemist Fritz Haber in the early 20th century, who aimed to extract gold from seawater to help pay off Germany's World War I reparations. Despite his groundbreaking work in chemistry, even Haber had to eventually concede defeat to the daunting impracticality of his venture. Fast forward to today, and the dream still lives on, fueled by advancements in nanotechnology and bioengineering. Researchers are tirelessly working on innovative methods to capture those elusive gold ions, exploring everything from bacterial processes to nanostructured materials. Yet these cutting-edge technologies are still in their infancy, teasing us with the potential of what could be. 
When we juxtapose the concept of mining gold from seawater with traditional gold mining practices, the contrast is stark. Traditional mining, despite its environmental and financial costs, zeroes in on significantly richer gold concentrations, making it a viable endeavor. In comparison, the gold in seawater, despite its mind-boggling overall volume, remains a mere curiosity, a testament to nature's ability to humble human ambition with its extreme dilution. But let's not view this as a defeat, rather it's a clarion call to the innovators, the dreamers, and the relentless pursuers of the impossible. I love gold! The ongoing research in material science, bioengineering, and potentially quantum chemistry hints at a future where extracting gold from the oceans could move from the realm of science fiction to reality. Imagine a world where we can economically harvest gold from seawater, opening new frontiers in resource extraction and challenging our current understanding of what's possible. Have you ever looked up at the stars and wondered about the gold on your finger or in your jewelry box? It might sound like something straight out of a science fiction novel, but there's a compelling theory that suggests the gold we cherish on Earth actually originated from the cosmos. Picture this. Billions of years ago, the Earth was showered with meteorites, acting as celestial delivery services, dropping off gold and other precious metals from the far reaches of space. This idea isn't just a flight of fancy. It's grounded in the scientific process of nuclear synthesis, where the unimaginable heat and pressure of supernova explosions or neutron star collisions forge atoms into heavier elements like gold. Once these elements are created, they're sent adrift across the universe, eventually becoming part of the stardust that formed our solar system and, by extension, our planet. Let's dive a bit deeper into this cosmic journey. The Earth, along with the other planets in our solar system, was born from the remnants of stars that exploded long before our Sun was even a twinkle in the universe's eye. During the Earth's infancy, around 4 billion years ago, it experienced what's known as the Late Heavy Bombardment, a period where it was pelted with meteorites. It's during this chaotic time that a significant portion of Earth's gold was delivered to its surface. But here's where things get really interesting. Some folks believe that this extraterrestrial gold didn't just arrive by chance, but was part of a deliberate seeding or mining operation by advanced alien civilizations. While this idea ventures into the realm of conspiracy theories, it's fascinating to think about aliens traveling across the cosmos with an interest in Earth's gold, perhaps using it to repair their own atmosphere or for other advanced technological purposes. Now let's put Earth's gold into a cosmic perspective, when we compare the gold found on our planet with the abundance of gold scattered across the universe, it highlights just how rare and precious this element is. In the vastness of space, gold is just one of many elements forged in the explosive furnaces of dying stars, devoid of any intrinsic value until it's found and treasured by beings like us. On Earth, gold has symbolized wealth, beauty and power for millennia, inspiring countless explorations and conquests. Yet in the cosmic scheme of things, it's a reminder of our planet's place in a much larger, more mysterious universe. The extraterrestrial origin theory of gold not only enriches our understanding of this precious metal's presence on Earth, but also ties our planet's history to the broader narrative of the cosmos. As we continue to explore space, venturing to asteroids and other planetary bodies in search of gold and other resources, we're not just pushing the boundaries of science and technology, we're also continuing the age-old human tradition of exploration and discovery. Who knows, the future might see us mining gold from asteroids, turning what was once science fiction into reality, and further proving that the story of Earth's gold is as vast and enigmatic as the universe itself.